I don't do those types of cases anymore. And once virginity is lost, it can never be found. I'm sorry I couldn't be of any more help, Sister Mary. How are you still alive? It's hard to believe, right? Do you ever have one of those mornings where you wake up on the sidewalk next to the on-ramp for the 405? Well, today was one of those mornings. <laughs> I don't know how I got there, but when I woke up, my head was pounding and my car was missing. It all started last night. I was on my way to the bar singing along to Beethoven's Royalty Free Ninth Symphony. <laughs> After walking into the bar, I ordered the usual. 15 shots of tequila. Excuse me. Are you gonna finish this? Anyway, that's when things started to turn sour. Whiskey sour. Boyfriend, Rod, broke up with me three hours ago because he said I couldn't find his penis. After that, I found something worth so much more inner strength. Here we go. Why did you leave me? <laughs> Body shot. I'm starting to realize that alcohol only amplifies one's current state of emotional being. The extreme highs are short-lived and not worth the depressing come down. How about I buy you a drink? Or 30? Yeah, sure. Two Shirley Temples, please. I'll never forget his silky smooth hair, his chiseled jawline. His terrible breath. I mean, it smelt like he was decaying from the inside. I think the alcohol is clouding your memory. <laughs> yeah, whatever. We decided to leave the bar, mostly because I had a $3,000 bar tab and no way of paying it. He insisted on driving, which I thought was a good idea, considering I don't even have a license. I was starting to fall for him. <laughs> Hey, Mom. Yeah, I met the girl of my dreams. Her name is Iris. No, 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 she's asleep in the car right now. Safe and sound. Yeah, I don't know what it is about her, but I just feel compelled to protect her. I guess you were right, Mom. Love is blind. <laughs> Everything after that is a blur. I'm sorry, I can't take this case. But how about I buy you a drink? Or 30? Wait a minute. It was you! You son of a bitch! That's no way to talk to your husband. I think we should get a divorce. Fine. But let's talk about this over drinks. You drive this time. I don't think that's a very good idea considering I am drunk and I'm blind. 
Everything makes sense now. Thank you.